Hey, this is Heather from the Renaissance English History Podcast, and this is your Tudor Minute for June the 13th. Today we celebrate the baptism of Richard Barnfield, a poet, in 1574 in Shropshire. He is interesting to scholars because he had a very close and yet very obscure relationship with Shakespeare. He is even considered to be the rival poet mentioned in Shakespeare's sonnets. He published poems throughout the 1590s with his first work, The Affectionate Shepherd, dedicated to Lady Rich. It was popular, but it was censored because it had homosexual content in it. And at least one of his sonnets, If Music and Sweet Poetry Agree, and the ode beginning As It Fell Upon a Day, which were once attributed to Shakespeare himself, but it's actually Richard Barnfield. I also like this poem because it mentions John Dowland, the famous lute composer. So let's take a listen. If music and sweet poetry agree... As they must needs, the sister and the brother, then must the love be great twixt thee and me, because thou lovest the one and I the other. Dowland to thee is dear, whose heavenly touch upon the lute doth ravish human sense. Spencer to me, whose deep conceit is such, as passing all conceit needs no defense. Thou lovest to hear the sweet melodious sound that Phoebus' lute, the queen of music, makes, and I in deep delight am chiefly drowned when as himself to singing he betakes one God is God of both as poets fame. One night loves both and both in thee remain. That's your Tudor Minute. Remember, you can dive deeper into life in 16th century England through the Renaissance English History Podcast at EnglandCast.com.